Welcome guys and girls in this video tutorial part 7 how to create a PHP website from scratch. In this tutorial we are going to create our uh, Java script uh, folder. Um, as you see I am now in our, uh, in our uh, PHP underscore website folder. Um, I want to create in this folder uh, a new folder. Yes. Name this folder JS. What we're going to do now is uh, when you have created this folder, we're going back to our HDDocs. You see that here at the top and uh, next to on the left side from PHP underscore website HDDocs. And we're opening our image slider folder where we have downloaded it, uh, our image slider. Then you go and double click on this one. And you see here this J uh, JS fo uh, folder. Inside that JS folder, we have all our jQuery uh, documents. Yes, we're copying this yeah, and we go back to our HDDocs, uh, HDDocs folder and then we go back to our PHP underscore website. Now we double click on our own JS folder. You see, this is now empty, but I want to paste all the jQuery stuff we have uh, copied just a second ago. So I put it all in there. As you see, we have now all the jQuery stuff what we're going to use in our slider. All right. Okay. Um, let's go back for uh, to our image slider. Um, in the next tutorial. Oh wait, let's create grab some images. Uh, we need this exam. We need all of this images even. So copy that. And then go back to our HDDocs folder, PHP underscore website, inside images, we're going to paste all of these images. So we only have to change later all of these images. See, the, these images are 800 width and 300 height. Okay? So let's go back again to our image slider. Yes. Uh, the CSS, we need all of these CSS even. So copy that, go back again to our HD Docs, and let's see. I want to go back for rename it CSS, okay? Let's go back to HD Docs to our PHP underscore website. Inside our style folder, we're going to put all of these. CSS uh, styles for our slider. See? Now I want to go back to our image slider again, download, where we have downloaded it. And now I want to see, we have our jQuery folder, our images, and our CSS for now. In the next tutorial, we're going to create the uh, slider and the content what we have at the back for our sli uh, slider. So, um, if you didn't see everything what we have done now then watch the video again from the part before this and uh, do the same like i did because i have created inside our hc docs folder a folder image slider and i downloaded the image slider inside that folder okay and for in this tutorial we have put all the things we're going to use our js our images, uh, our styles, uh, CSS styles, I've all put that in this tutorial, all in, okay? So in the next tutorial, I want uh, to create uh, the uh, background for our slider, and I want to create a little bit of our uh, slider. So I hope to see you in the next uh, couple of tutorials, and uh, then we're going to create our slider. When our slider has uh, been created, then the tutorial is uh, almost finished and you can create uh, the other pages and uh, like about us and because we're going to use almost the same code on every page so we have a nice decent website with no, uh, uh, no bad look uh, on the page. So I hope to see you in the next uh, tutorial. Bye.